It's another beautiful day. Uh, we're here with mm, mm. They're trying to make uh, some toasted uh, bread. She's from Nigeria. She came today. Um, she told me that she had a very bad uh, experience on the plane. Uh, that she was taken all the way to Zanzi Zanzi but Dar es Salaam. Dar es Salaam. Yeah, from Rwanda to Dar es Salaam. I don't know what they are going to do there, but at least you saw Dar es Salaam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, we're having a small breakfast lunch. Brunch. Brunch, yes. I already took my breakfast, but now it's just a part of it. And then maybe we can think about something else later. So peace, let me charge my camera. <laughs> we have a small problem here. Water just poured everywhere. Everywhere, everywhere. We forgot to uh, put out the pipe from the machine. We were washing clothes and then this happened. Yeah. yeah. Housewife. One million, no. Yeah, yeah. One million yards. <laughs> One million yards of oh my. material. Oh my, my, my. So water is everywhere, literally everywhere. But the clothes, I think they are, <laughs> they are ready. Washed. They are washed. <laughs> Today we are eating jollof rice. And that's I hope it. the jollof rice comes out well. If it doesn't come out well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And if it doesn't come out well, you have never eaten. So we won't know. Yeah, we won't know. Oh, thank God. We will I can't cook know. anything. Concoction rice, village we rice. Not, we will not know actually. You don't eat jollof rice before? No, I just fear. Now you have to eat it. So Kenya doesn't have jollof rice. Okay, it's only West Africa that has jollof rice. Is, does it mean it is from giraffes? No. <laughs> That's why it was called giraffe. It's not giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> it's jollof. Jollof. Yeah. What does that jollof mean? I don't know. No. <laughs> that one, I don't know. I'm going to ask, find out the. I will go and find out why it's called jollof rice. Jollof. Some people call it jollof. And, and I was born into it. I just. We're eating jollof in your way. For one day, for one thing in our day. Today we are with Tenny, Tenny herself. <laughs> this one you guys are so excited, like. Okay. Oh yeah, oh baby. I saw you smile, I knew that very soon I'd get to know ya And maybe in a matter of time you were We're still adding more spices, more and more and more and more and more hey. there's, there's a cover there, at, uh, just next to the utensils there, yeah, yeah You know funny thing when you in a man's house, men only have a few things. I made a video the other day, I was saying that a man should only have three cooking pans, Why? two for cooking and one for emergency. Why should you, <laughs> why should you have many? Why, why, why are you taking them? But men also cook now. Just because you don't cook doesn't mean that men don't cook. No, I cook. I cook sometimes. It's almost overcooked. You mean this rice already cooked? No, it hasn't. Almost. It hasn't cooked now. Okay, why did you remove it like halfway? Yeah, because we still need to do the jello first. You so have to pop all the rice halfway first. Oh, it's cooked halfway first. Yeah, then when you put it into the jello sauce, you you cook it the second time. So you don't allow it to get too soft the first time. If not, you ah, need to soak it. Okay. You see, like, the rice was half cooked. Okay, I think I've known something. I didn't know. It's supposed to steam. Yeah. Just steaming, not not to. Yeah, before before I put water inside, I want the spices to enter it. <laughs> okay. So it's just steaming. So now he's putting on some water on the steamed. Uh... Chicken. Yes. Let's give it an okay. This is the local chicken. You can see tomato is supposed to be blended. That's news. As for us, we don't blend. Actually, what we do, we usually um, just cut cut as we eat. 
as we eat some pieces along the way. <laughs> you have to shake it like that when you're blending. I don't necessarily have to shake it, but I want it to go down so that everything oh, blends. Okay. Tomorrow I'll be the cookist or the cooker. <laughs> Cookita. So that one makes it more red. It's supposed to yeah. have a lot of red color. Like that's the, the logo or something of the rice. <laughs> and this is a soup which remained from the uh, chicken. Just also some wok. And then as well we have um, we have this. This is a fish. Which has been uh, removed all uh, bones. bones. Then the fried chicken. We're waiting so the list can dry the oil. Then we can think from there. This is that how we're pouring? Hey. For those who are asking what I'm doing, this is now how we make jollof rice. Now, finally, the spice has just uh, mixed with the rice. And you can tell for sure. Ooh, me. <laughs> oh yeah. Mmm. Chineke. <laughs> I tell you, I feel as if I'm in Lagos. I feel as if I'm in those movies that I see. It's really amazing. More and more spices, okay. So a little bit because by the time the rice cooks, it will absorb some part of the spice. All right. How long will this take now before it's uh, ready? It don't, don't take long. And the reason I'm actually putting. Uh, and now you put the the chicken. Yeah. Another magic, guys. Chicken is about to get in. Yeah, the chicken will take the the, spice. the? The spices. Yeah, the spice of the stew. So, it's a so uh, the fire is still off, and then now you put it on. Yeah. Okay. This one is for me to test. Mmm. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the man gets the gizzard. Mmm. <laughs> Stories from Nigeria. Stories about what? Yeah. Why are you guys here so many? 200 million 200 million people 200 million people those are so many and uh, I hear that 80% uh, of people there are actors they are acting artists either an actor a musician something they are more than the fans who told you that no like we see like uh, Art is very big. You know, like here in Kenya, we play um, Nigerian music like we don't have our own. 
Nigeria music and uh, Tanzania music is played all the time. But it doesn't mean that there are. If we are 200 million, then we have just few artists now. Uh, okay. But anyway. I defended them, right? Defending them too much, but. <laughs> Oh, that one will still be used somewhere. In case, in case the food is not peppery enough. <laughs> and we already put like seven pieces of pepper. No, it wasn't seven, like five. Okay. Actually, it's almost ready, yeah? Yeah, it's almost ready. Finally, we have jollof rice. Jollof rice. Almost ready. Two minutes to be ready. So you are to put this one. Are you still adding more? No, there's water still inside and it's about to get done. So I don't think I'll add anything. Oh, it's supposed to come out dry, like really yeah, dry. Yeah, yeah, dry. Okay. Awesome. I can't wait to test this jollof rice. Funny enough, there's still um, fish inside. There's chicken. There's all the spices and all that. This is my first time testing jollof rice. I can't wait. This green pepper. What? Green? It's that green pepper. Yeah. It's not the same taste. It gave it a different taste. A unique taste. You know I'm about to give it a review, so uh, she's starting to make some excuses. Uh, but anyway, I'll give a very honest review of this uh, jollof rice. I'm just sitting down here waiting for the final touches. I'm about to call my friend uh, Rollins to come also give me a, a review as well. Today Macquiens is will not even win us. Today we are the review, um, number one in reviews. So no excuses, this is going to be extremely detailed review about how uh, jollof rice was testing. Is it a good thing or did it taste bad? And so yes so it will be very honest very very honest the food is ready finally and the judges are here they're about to make their they're about to make their Rollins verdict he's just hungry he just wants to eat he no he's hungry. also a judge uh, i think i'm gonna tell this yeah hey judge uh, Rollins, <laughs> yes, what do you think about this food now we're just about please give us a honest review okay i have to test it before i eat yes before please I eat. kindly you can serve on the cock side of life and then now we can see the way forward so let's serve it and then now we can think about eating all right oh you will still think about it yeah of course definitely right oh my you can just see the way it's teeming good so i can say haven't yet tested i'm about to taste it but uh rollins take the first bite tell us how you feel it it's hot this is the low price. <laughs> Have you ever even tried one? Yeah, I've tried, but this is the, you know, like it's uh, the original one. Original one. <laughs> yeah, for sure. For sure. Okay, somebody's about to be given more marks for <laughs> telling us about this. So, anyway, let me give you my review. thinking here mm, the dish is really good I can feel it from mm? mm -hmm. and my soda was almost going down I think they didn't just want me to talk about but anyway she's a good cook I can say for sure everything is so yummy I don't know how to explain no Macquiat always has all the words, but for me, all I can say is wow, it's really good. Really, really good. I just don't want to stop. This is just like amazing. And uh, even my friend Ronnie said this is amazing, so I think we'll be doing this every day for the next two days before we leave. <laughs> 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 
That was really, really puffy. 